Um, yo, it's Earth, don't feel a fucking day, you know, shouts to Direct, Rap Grid, all that shit. Um, yeah, we're here at Apache Cafe, like, just had the event. Um, the event was crazy, man, like, as far as just events in general, like, that was one of our best events we had in a while, like, it was a really nice crowd, they are really receptive, they showed so much love, like, every battle had fucking stepped up, there was no chokes, no anything, man, like, um, I'm worn out as hell now, I just come out of the battle with John John, which was amazing as well, it was brilliant, but, like, yeah, the event as a whole was just crazy, like, we didn't really know how it was going to be, like, we didn't know if there was going to be five people here or whatever, or, you know what I mean, if they were going to really be that receptive towards us, or and we didn't know if the American battlers would be coming prepared, unprepared. We, did, we had no idea really to be honest. We've been working on it for a while and like we didn't really know what's going to go on. But right now I'm feeling really happy. Like the event was crazy. Just like it was good. It was good to see everybody take it seriously. Do you know what I mean? Like that was that was the best part of it, man. There was not like one person on the stage that didn't take it seriously. Like John John. I'll be honest. Like, I thought I thought John John was going to be whack. <laughs> like, that's as simple as that. I thought he was gonna be shit, but he was fucking crazy. That's some of the best like shit I've had said to me in a while, man. Like his uh, uh, delivery and presence when he's spitting is mad. Like when you're up there battling with him, and he actually had a lot of lyrics. Like I didn't really think he was gonna come with anything but just stupid multiple choice rubbish. But like, do you think that he was your, he was your toughest opponent? Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know. I mean, my last opponent was pe my last solo opponent was DNA. I think there he was maybe more like more direct. Like I think. I think, yeah, I'd say John John had more stuff that was like about me. Yeah, I had a lot of like weird personal shit that wasn't true, but I mean, genuinely, like when the whole stuff about like, you know, I'm battling a president and it, I liked all that stuff and it was about me as well. So I'd say he was probably tougher than DNA, but the DNA battle was just a classic because it just was what it was, you know? But, and uh, favorite battle of the night? Um, do you know what? I'd probably say Impact and Bricks Belvedere purely, but for a, it's a biased point of view, like purely because uh, it's so good to see Impact get his name out here because nobody in the room knew him at all. Um, and I like Bricks since the Sue Surf battle, I've always liked him. He, he had some sick wordplay and shit as well, but like just because I just, I just feel good for Impact that he came out, he delivered his shit, he didn't choke, he, did, he killed it, the crowd like lapped it up. Like, and it's a, when you've never battled abroad before, like I've been doing this for like five, six years, I've been battling abroad, so like for him, to like come out here and just kill it like that and have the whole crowd on his side when he's not even from here, that was probably my favourite battle. But uh, also, uh, Sid Vicious and Cyborg, which I, I wish we'd booked that as a three rounder. Like, that was fucking crazy. The delivery and the bars and the gum shit and whatever, like, it was mad. And I, I, I really regret not booking that as a three rounder. But probably those two battles, definitely. Yeah.